A short but sweet story here for you guys. A missing cat has been reunited with a family after 10 years. This is from the Good News Hub, guys. Let's go. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. This is really going to leak here. We're another episode of Good News, Good Vibes, where once a week, guys, I share with you a good news story, and you can decide whether or not you like it or not. To be fair, guys, I think sometimes that um, since I've been doing these, it's like it's a, it's different to what I normally do, and we always need to remind ourselves that in this world full of negative and bad stuff, here, it's always nice to have a really good, warm-hearted story. And I really, uh, I really have been struggling actually to find a lot of good warm high stories, believe it or not. But I've got this one here for you, and I hope you guys enjoy it. It's a small one, it's a short one, but it's a nice one here. You know, for a cat to go missing <laughs> is is sad. It's always sad if you have a cat and it goes missing. And sometimes it could be a couple of days, and you just find out, oh, it's just eaten in the neighbour. Or sometimes they can go as long, sometimes even two weeks, and they end up popping and appearing. But <clears throat> ten years. 10 years reunited i mean this is just this is just beyond rare this is extraordinary extraordinary thing because normally when you don't see a cat after such a long time you really do give up hope and it's it's a very sad state of affairs when a cat disappears and you have no idea what happened but for 10 years re reunion it's quite an amazing astonishing thing so lilia ellington never thought she would see her cat whiskers again However, the pair have been reunited in emotional return more than 10 years after the beloved feline went missing. Whiskers, who is 16 years old, was found in Chewton Moor near Durham in the UK, which is close to where she lived before disappearing. A local resident found her taking res refuge in his shed and took her to a vet in December where she was found to have an old RSPCA microchip. And this is the benefit of having a microchip, microchip in your cat. Or dog for that matter, so that if they go missing, they could one day end up back in your hands again. Whiskers was adopted by Linda in 2007 after being found as a stray kitten by the RSPCA in Scotland. After living with Linda for six years, Whiskers disappeared with his family, moving house and giving up hopes of seeing their pet again. Linda, who last saw Whiskers in 2013, was alerted after a charity put out an online appeal. Oh. When I first saw the RSPCA Facebook post, I just thought it can't possibly be Whiskers after all these years, she said, adding... I thought the photo looked like her, but it had been so long and I never thought we would see her again. <clears throat> we thought she had found somewhere else to live and she didn't come in one night. The RSPCA inspector David Dunnan, who said it was emotional to see the pair reunited. It was a pleasure to see that we were able to reunite Linda the Whiskers. After all these years, she just had a cuddle with her and it was very emotional to see. I doesn't look Whiskers doesn't look very uh, very happy about it. Maybe maybe I'm jumping the gun here. I don't know about you, but that's a, a face of a cat that's not pleased. Oh, it's you again. <laughs> maybe maybe I'm jumping a little bit, but <laughs> um, it's, cats sometimes have some of the weirdest weirdest faces, don't they? <laughs> It's thought that Whiskers spent her time as a stray for the past 10 years and has since developed a kidney infection which will require an ongoing treatment. Despite her ordeal, the black and white feline is recovering well and living with Linda's brother David. She's 16 and now I've got a dog. It would be difficult for a cat her age to live with me when my brother David was only happy to take her and keep her in the family. Okay, so she's got a dog now and obviously the age of the cat, um, understandably, but it's, not, it's a nice to see um, a reunion like that. Uh, to say that these guys, you know, it's it's 10 years. I still can't believe it's been 10 years. It's quite an extraordinary little story, guys, but um, fascinating one to say the least. Um, that That is for sure, guys. Um, you know, pets are, can, then they're sometimes are worth value, more value to, to us than even our own, our own species, especially when they become, when you become so close and attached to them. And then when they're long over here, it can be absolutely devastating for all of us. And um, <clears throat> I, I love seeing reunion, like, reunifications like this. It really is a nice, warm-hearted story. And what did you guys make of Whiskers? What did you make of that face Whiskers had in the photo there? Have you had a cat disappear for 
a years, 10 years or a year or anything like that. Tell us if you have any cats of your own and stories of your own, please feel free to share them in the comments section down below. I have two cats here and um, so we had um, one cat disappear for about a week maybe um, and uh, we actually thought that she wasn't going to come back and she did and she since then has never left the house believe it or not only to go out in the garden and that's about it um, but she's a very old cat as well um, but um, let me know share your stories in the comment section down below and what you thought of this lovely story if you can hit the like button we greatly appreciate it. share it across social media and subscribe because it really does help support the channel so thanks so much for watching guys and i hope to catch you all very very soon Thank <music> you.